Good morning, everyone that didn't take out my glasses. I hope nobody didn't think to have their books back on the screen like that. Um, so, as you can see in the thumbnail there, I'm doing a Von Hala Java Coffee review. Now, this is made by Deathwish Coffee. And Deathwish Coffee, oh my god. That little neighborhood, yeah. That fish coffee. They also have merch. Uh, you can buy coffee cups from them. Um, and uh, I've been thinking about that. I'm a coffee cup collector. Um, if it's a collectible coffee mug, absolutely. So, um, I'm gonna try this. Now, this is the whole bean. As I'm hoping you can see that. Okay. <laughs> this is the whole bean. Um, and I will say I did struggle to open the bag a little, but I had to cut under the part that actually closes it shut. And then I just tacked this back on the bag and it was done with it. No big deal. It, it happens. So. I haven't put my coffee creamer in my coffee yet, so it's black coffee. Oh yeah, you can't tell it blends with the cauldron. <laughs> the cauldron. My coffee cup of choice. <laughs> oh, just doing that laugh on purpose. So anyway, um, tell you what it's like just black before I put coffee creamer in it. It's got a nice flavor. It's not overpowering. It does have a little taste of a bitter. Let's see, I drink water a lot, so my taste buds are flushed. If you have that white film on your tongue, your, your taste buds are art. Uh, yeah, it's got can still taste it. It's got that little of a bitter aftertaste before adding anything to it. Now what I'm adding to it is uh, the Italian sweet cream coffee creamer. I always shake it and the reason that I shake it is because you get a nice broth in your coffee. There was just enough left in here for my cup. Um, but yeah, you get a nice broth on the top of your coffee. So. sugar to my coffee. I guess you could do this if you wanted to extra take the bitter off, but I'm not going to do that. I like it. I like it the way it is. I did get me some more Deathwish coffee. This came in a bundle pack. I can't find this in the grocery store. I did notice that they lowered the price of the Deathwish coffee down to what it is on the internet. But if you buy both the Deathwish and this in a bundle pack, it costs less than buying two bags singularly. Yeah, I said that right. <laughs> I haven't had my all of my coffee yet. So, yeah, it... It's not a bad coffee. Um, the rambunctious, uh, I mispronounced that. The rambunctious kitten in the house. It's funny because he, for some reason, likes coffee. So my friend will get his beer and give the cat a little taste of coffee. Calms the cat right down as if the coffee is the cat's riddle. <laughs> Then the cat calms down. Seriously, it doesn't hurt animals. Um, 
actually be surprised. Um, animals used to eat coffee beans, and it didn't hurt them. I actually gave them a pep, unless they were originally too hyper in the first place, and then I calmed them down. Um, it's the same thing with children. You have a hyperactive child. I just call it being a child. Or one that they're too overactive and a poquito destructive. Give them some coffee in the morning, they're good. You're good. <laughs> Calms them right down. Uh, I've told you guys about this. When my oldest boy was in Head Start, one of the kids that he was in that class with was really out of control and I happened to be able to stop him they, uh, to go cup of coffee <laughs> and I gave the kids a sip of my coffee and I said he calmed right down he didn't he calmed right down um sometimes the best medicine that's not a prescription is uh, controlling things with food. Absolutely. Like, if I ate only junk food and didn't take care of my skin right, I would look all wrinkled for my age. And sorry about that. There was something on my screen, a thing about that. Um, I would probably look all wrinkled. But then have, yeah, you know what I mean. But, uh, you know, diet and exercise, and, you know, you got to take care of your health. So, with that said, if you want to try the Von Hala, I got the whole bean, so this is freshly ground. Mmm. It's good. It's got a nice flavor. It said if you drink it black, it's going to kick back a bitter on your tongue. Put some creamer in it. It'll tone it down. This is good. I'm going to give it a thumbs up. I'm only giving you a recommendation. But if you decide to I love the artwork on this. After I'm done with this bag, I may actually cut off that piece of artwork. Because I think it's cool. And I may lay it on something. But I don't know what, but I'll figure that out. I mean, I could draw that, but I'm not going to draw it. This is such a beautiful bag. Oh, the Death Wish coffee bag is cool, too. Um, but anyway, guys, like I said, this is on my recommendation. I'll be back later with more video. And there is something that I left out in my 31 looks of Halloween video to tell you guys something. Well, I might as well just tell you now. If you're going to go looking through the videos, looking for the strange anomalies, okay, and I'm going to count how many times it was a strange anomaly. Um, I'm so tired last night. I had to edit this part out. So to ante it up, I'm going to make a small sewing basket. For whoever comes closest to the number that I found. Now, should I include the channel that I no longer have access to? No, we're with this channel, M. Or I would, because I know, excuse me, a few creepy things in that one. But, um, 
definitely try the coffee at Boma because since you can get it in a bundle pack and it costs less than buying singular packs of coffee in the shipping. Oh my gosh, that's so quick. And then you earn rewards from uh, Deathwish. So, uh, discount rewards, which I think is cool. Yeah, I know. I said I didn't order online, but I had to because they have the price of the coffee way too high at the store. So, at first, and they adjusted, um, which I'm grateful for that. But at least I got to taste the Von Paula. So stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and always stay loved. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I did. I said, I'm trying not to brain fart here. I'm not really <laughs> um, So if you come closest to that number, I will announce a winner of the sewing basket. It's international. Don't be afraid to look international so, um, and you get to learn you get to learn there's so much teaching to do for sewing you know um, so you'll get to learn and later on towards the next couple of months before the end of the year I may do something else as a giveaway thing. I don't care, I don't have that many people um, you know, to come to my channel. I don't need that many people to flock to my channel to do a giveaway. I'm just gonna do it. That's right. That is right. So anyway guys, like I said, stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always stay blessed. And I will see you. All of you, I hope. Um, for the next video. Because I have that song to finish up today for my friend's mom. And then, um, if I have enough time in the day, I may even show you how to make a fleece coat. Oh, did I say that? Yeah, I did. Anyway, <laughs> I'm excited to use the fabric. I already washed it. That's right. All right, see you later. <laughs>